Hey, Mr. Splashman. Shaylin, stop. Hi, the real Robbie part two. Thank you. Okay. So, hey, y'all, I'm Leilani. I am cooking our dinner tonight. Hey, Dante. I'm making spazagna. It's one of my kids' favorite things. When I don't have time to make lasagna, because I like to make my lasagna a day ahead of time, I make spazagna because it has all the same ingredients. It's just, you know, made like spaghetti. It's just all in the pot. And, you know, you get all the flavors, but it doesn't take as long. And they don't have to wait a day. Quite. So, I use... Um, this ground beef and pork blend. And then I also use Italian sausage. I'm cooking spazagna. Thank you, real Robbie. He asked everyone to hit the like button. Hi, the official. Hi, time reveals. And I go ahead and I cook my um my ground meat and my sausage together because it's already ground beef and pork mixed together anyway. So it's not like I'm doing anything different. There's actually a restaurant that has lasagna. I think it might be Cheesecake Factory. Or um, Cheddar's. Either Cheesecake Factory or Cheddar's actually makes lasagna also. I'm going to change my gloves because those have meat on them. Hi, Victor. I'm making spazagna. When I fix my meat, I also go ahead and I put um, chopped onions. And um, garlic in there. I usually put uh, bell pepper in there also, but I don't have any bell pepper right now. So I'm just doing my um, yeah. onions and my garlic. And this is kind of new. I like this garlic here. You can buy it in the frozen department. It's just little pouches of crushed garlic that they have already cut up for you and it's just frozen in these little frozen things you peel it back and you just pop them out and i use two of them thank you white tupac
And then I'm going to season. Hey, pretty girl, loving it. Got some black pepper. Onion powder. And I don't measure eyeball. <laughs> so I couldn't tell you how many teaspoons, tablespoons I use. I just eyeball. So. That's some Lari seasoning salt. This is some Spanish style paprika. And then this is some Italian seasoning. And over here, I have some of Chef Carmen's um, I Got You seasoning. Use a little of that. Rayon. In the seasoning cabinet, in the Ziploc baggie, there's some anti-fee seasoning. Bring me that. Anti-fee? Yep. But in the cabinet? Yeah, in the seasoning cabinet. It's in the Ziploc bag. You bring me that. Hi, guys. Hi, baby. They can't see you. My daughter's saying hi. No, not that one. This is a little pouch by itself, not that one. Oh. Hers is a little pouch all by itself. This one. Okay. And this one is some anti fee seasoning that she made me before she died. So I'm going to put a little anti fee in here. Hi, welcome to the Nine Kelly Bears. Hi, Miss Ariana. Do I miss anybody else? I got time reveals. And I put in a little bit of lemon pepper.
And back here in my pressure cooker, I have um, some rice cooking. Tomorrow I'm going to be making Japanese food. I'm going to be making gyoza, egg rolls, and fried rice. So I'm making my um, rice right now because when you make fried rice, you want to make it a day ahead of time because you want to put it in the refrigerator and let it get cold because your fried rice is always better when you cook it with cold rice. So that's my rice. It's actually already done. I'm just letting the pressure release now. And then once it's all cool, put it in the refrigerator, let it get cold overnight. And then tomorrow I can make my fried rice with that. So that's what that is. What, baby? I'm busy. Okay. Spazania is, um, it's like spaghetti, but it is my spaghetti with all the ingredients that I put in my lasagna. So when I make lasagna, I use uh, ground beef, I use ground sausage, I use Italian sausage, and then I put um, ricotta cheese, cottage cheese, um, Italian blend cheese, and I put Parmesan, Romano, and Asiago cheese all in my lasagna. So all of that is going to go into this lasagna. And then I am using um, Bucatini pasta, which is kind of like spaghetti, but it actually has a hole in it. So it's like spaghetti pasta, but there's a hole in the middle. So, yeah. And then um, I'm not making my own sauce. This is, um, I'm using jarred sauce today. So this is um, Classico four cheese sauce, which is what I'm going to be using. Um, and I'm going to be making some um, cheese toast, Texas toast, to go with it. Um, yeah, that's everything I'm putting in there. So it's just kind of a quick dish because tomorrow I'm doing a lot. I'm making Japanese food tomorrow and that's a lot. Um, I'm going to do a lot of my prep for that tonight. Um, it is in my, um, Wolfgang Puck Bursa cooker. This will do crock pot stuff. It also does, um, it browns, it sautés, it does everything. I love this thing. I've had it for like six years now. This thing does everything. It slow cooks, it browns, it sautés. I love this thing right here. I love this thing. But yeah, right now it's on sear. So it's literally browning my meat and my onions and stuff. What are y'all doing? No, that's not playing. Sit down before you break something. Um, it's literally browning my um, onions and everything. The uh, onion soup that I made the other day, I cooked everything in here. I browned the oxtails in here. I browned those onions in here. I did everything right here in this pot and then turned around and cooked the soup in here. Like, I love this thing. When I got hurt and I couldn't walk, um, as you see right now, I'm sitting in my bed doing this because um, my back is killing me and my leg is killing me. So, <laughs> But when I couldn't walk, I did all my cooking in this thing right here. I cooked breakfast, lunch, and dinner using this and using a uh, um, little um, toaster oven. Um, just having my daughter bring the stuff to me at that point, at that time I was actually on the couch cause I was in a different house. I was in a rent house at that time. This one's my house, but I was in a rent house at that time. And my room was all the way in the back of the house and I couldn't hop my way, um, from my room to the restroom, which was really far away. Um, so I just stayed on the couch 
Um, but she would just, you know, I'd tell her what I needed to cook and she would just bring it all to me to the couch. And I just stayed on the couch and I did all my cooking and stuff from right there. She'd bring me a, a big um, basin to wash in and all that stuff. And I did everything from right there um, using this thing, a pressure cooker and a little toaster oven. And I would do it right there. So, um, you know, I do a lot of stuff still now. Like if I'm in a lot of pain, I'll just be like, hey, bring everything here. <laughs> So sometimes I do it this way. But this thing, yeah, it it helped me a lot. I love this thing. Yeah. Thank you, Miss Ariana. I had, um, well, at that time, that was before I had my knee replaced, but I had um, a surgery on my knee first to try and prolong me having to have my knee replaced. So I had um, this long brace thing on my leg, so I couldn't bend my leg at all. It was just, you know, a straight out thing from my hip all the way down to my ankle. And, you know, I couldn't walk, I couldn't do anything. I was just stuck. And um, it does smell really good. It smells so good in here right now. And so um, I was like that for four weeks while it healed. And um, no, yeah, I think it was four weeks, three or four weeks. And um, while, you know, I was stuck like that, you know, I still had to feed my kids. So it was like, you know, okay, we're going to do something, you know, figure it out. So they never missed a meal. <laughs> but once it finally, you know, I got out of that thing, they put me in a brace that, you know, like a robot, I called it my robo leg. It was one of those mechanical type braces that allowed me to bend it and move and walk. Well, once I got into that one and all the swelling went down and stuff, well, um, the issue that I was having before was my knee would pop itself out of place all the time. So the surgery was supposed to stop my knee from popping itself out of place. Well, what it did was my knee popped itself out of place after that but the surgery prevented it from popping itself back into place. It wouldn't go back because they had tightened it up. So then I was stuck with my knee out of place. So I had to have my knee replaced because now it wouldn't go back anymore. So it was so crazy. So I ended up having to have the replacement anyway because I had the surgery to fix it. So I wouldn't have to have a replacement. <laughs> Right. You can use that the surgery to not have the inches made do not have it. Right. Tell them about the leg. The foot. Hey, outsider. Do what, baby? The foot? Now, the foot is a whole other story, baby. The foot is when I accidentally knocked over the portrait when she tripped on me. I think that what happened? No. Yeah. I went through it. Yes. Okay. So this is almost done. And then I'm going to have to strain this grease off. What are you getting ready to eat? I'm cooking dinner. That's two sandwiches. That's not a sandwich. That's a. Two I'm cooking dinner. Sandwich. Why are you gonna have two sandwiches? Because I'm sorry, baby. I can't help it. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Megan. 
I'm fixing this lasagna I was telling you about yesterday. Yeah. Or was that today? Whenever it was. <laughs> I love Okay. It'll be up here. Okay, so as you see, my meat's brown. I'm going to pull it out, turn it off, pull it out so I can get rid of this grease. What y'all are hearing are, is my daughter and her robo baby. Don't turn it up. saying gorilla. Bella baby. She's a um, was it artificial intelligence? Interactive baby. Can you 
this room again. Yeah. She broke and didn't say, excuse me. Yeah, I figured it's not even bedtime. I turn you up and I look. Great. Good. Yes, they are, Miss Ariana. They really are. There's also a um. Another Bella boy. Another Bella boy, mommy. There is. Yeah. I didn't see that one. Um, there's a cabbage patch that's supposed to be similar. But that one, um, like in the store, you know, you can't, you can't, you know, interact with it. You can't see it in the store. Veins. Okay, outsider, I have two girls, 11 and 7. 11, 7, 11. What if you had three children or a boy and two girls? Well, that was what I always wanted, but I didn't have it, so. I have two girls. I want four babies. You want four? Yes. Well, they don't stay babies, so you have to say you want four children. I want four children. <laughs> they're only babies for a very short amount of time. And then they call it. They might want to pretend they're babies for a long time like you, but they're not babies. <laughs> Mommy, now baby girls, I have four now. I now I have four baby girls. Mm -hmm. Are you good on baby dolls now? No. You're not? No, 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 no. No. I don't think you're getting a love of Bella Boy. Why? 
<laughs> okay, so here's my meat. It's all done. There's no more pink in there. It's good. I'm going to taste it to see if it's seasoned good. Was that glass? Was that glass I heard, Rayon? No, that was a spoon. <sighs> That was like the metal thing that's on the back of that car seat. She was wearing back in that car seat. Come here. Ooh, I get to taste it. Mmm. <gasps> mmm. Mm. Get the um pot holders because you gotta pour this heat um grease out. Pot holders are down there. Mommy, where did you get this big old box at the end of what is what's Pour it outside in trash can. Do what? What is this thing? What's inside of this thing? I don't think I have anything in there. That's where like blankets and um, towels and um, sheets and stuff like that go. Or you can put sweaters and stuff like that in there. Like Bubbles, can you put bubbles, toys and stuff in it. If it was in y'all's room, it could be toys, but it's in my room, so I wouldn't have toys in it. Would have your supplies and stuff. In it. Supplies. Yes. Okay. Supplies. <laughs> no, I wouldn't put groceries in it. Why? Because that's not what it's for. Ow. Here is the stick, stick, skitty stick. This is one hard to stick. Mommy, why is the stick so big and strong? Because it's a sugar cane. They're very, very tall. They're strong. I can't even break it with your cinch drop. Alright. I don't think even this is a good thing. Because the shoes hang on the way over. Okay. It's so now I'm going to do my noodles really quick. Water is yummy. Yes, water is yummy. Very, very yummy. Turn this back on, put it back on sear. Put some salt in there. Salt in the water. You always put salt in your water when you're boiling noodles. 
You bring it to the salinity of the sea. So the sea tasted like the sea salt. is salty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Have you been to the sea? Mm-hmm. You've been to the sea too, remember? You were chasing the birds. Oh, and I tasted some. It was nasty. Yeah. Too salty. Yeah. I like them. Hi, Joe Alice. I was trying to get them out of the sky. You were trying to get them out of the water. They were in the water. Mm hmm. I mean, remember that Sonic toy that I got? That I got? It was that blue thing. It's still under a bed. We put it under a bed. Mm hmm. I don't remember toys that came from Happy Meals and stuff. I know you remember my Luigi's. You just got those. That was Shopkins. Shopkins were there. I got the window. Oh, Ryan, come get the garlic and put it back in the freezer, please. You almost stabbed a baby in the face with that sugar cane. We are good, Joelle. That's how are you? Hey, you're beating the baby. I'll go get the wanky. <coughs> Medicine. I wonder if that I had to take that. Oh, do I have to take that? Shayla needs to take this first. I am making spazania. I can't open these pills. Okay, hold on, I'll open it. Medicine is hard to open. But do you have keys? Yep. Because that for keys to open. You just need one. You put them back in here. This is good. Now we have one. Okay. Where's the honey? Somewhere in this area. <laughs> it's um, basically you take all the ingredients that you would put in your lasagna and then you take it and put it in a pot with spaghetti noodles but I'm not using spaghetti noodles I am using Bucatini pasta, which is like spaghetti, but it actually has a hole in it. They're thicker than spaghetti. Okay. Okay. 
Planet. She made me go. Let's turn on. Rayanna, if you take this, need to come with this garlic in the freezer and then bring me the um the beef base. You're kissing very loudly, Shannon. Yeah. I was going to get you some shoes, but I didn't. I have ground beef, ground sausage, and Italian sausage in here. That's what I put in my lasagna. Yeah, She didn't make them right. What did she do? She left a bunch of water in there. You're not supposed to have water in it. You're supposed to pour the water out. Because you ate them. You didn't think they were disgusting. I think they were. You got some chips Thank you, Joalice. What are you stepping on? What keeps popping? Move that. Ugh, waiting for water to boil. Yeah, put that in the freezer and bring me the uh, beef base. Um, maybe about Normally, you'd be cooking in two separate pots, so you'd have your noodles cooking, you know, in one pot, and your meat would have been in another pot, so it'd be all together at the same time. So, like, in 45 minutes, you could probably be done, but because I'm doing mine separately, mine's going to take longer. Um...
but you know, if he was actually in your kitchen, <laughs> um, doing it the normal way, I say about forty-five minutes. You know, because you just want to, you know, you brown your meat, boil your noodles, and then you're just gonna put it all together and give it about, you know, once you bring it all together, give it about, you know, 10, 15 minutes to simmer together, you know, just for the flavors to meld and you're done. All I did just now was I just put some beef base in my water just to give some flavor to the pasta water. You know, you can use chicken, you know, chicken stock or whatever, but since I just use plain water, I just put some beef base in there. That's like using, you know, beef stock. Here I am. <laughs> And then come back, I'm going to give you these seasonings. Watch out, don't start pulling stuff. You're going to make my meat fall. Stop, stop, stop. Put it back where I had it. Just stop moving my stuff. I had that all in the bag. Put it back in my bag and leave it. Seasoning. Basketball practice. Okay. Okay. So what I'm gonna do right now is while we're waiting on hey, while we're waiting on this to come to a boil, I want y'all to come over here and I'm gonna let y'all taste this Gatorade and I want y'all to guess the flavor. Okay. 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 There's too much stuff in the wedding. Just scoop that one. This way. Yes. Or here. Unplug this. Wait. There's a plug behind it. Unplug the plug. Right here. From here. Unplug the plug. Um, Don't pull that away. You're showing your presents. Ooh. Is it unplugged? No. It's very Just pull it out. Got it. This came loose. We don't need that. Yes, we do. All right, go sit that on the table in the kitchen. Grab the handles on the, on the sides. Now, put that blanket back down. And you scoot this way. Stop pulling the blanket off. Put the blanket back. Now, you scoot this way. Where am I 
Just sit over there. You're fine. They can see your face. Okay. Scoop this way and let Shet Rayon come over here and uh, over here in the spot. Yes. Sit on the bed. <laughs> Don't sit in the hole, sit on the bed. You know you're going to fall straight down. All right. Okay, so I bought... a Gatorade. I actually drank one myself at work. Uh, day before yesterday. And um, it's a very unique flavor. And is it raspberry beret? What raspberry beret? Raspberry beret. Raspberry beret. 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 No, do you know what a beret is? A hat. So you want something <laughs> that tastes like a hat? Yes, yeah, just like I want. Some jelly beans that taste like poop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I would be really, really surprised if they were jelly beans that taste like poop. Are you gonna blindfold us? Put on the blindfold because I don't want you to read it. I can Mommy. read. <laughs> Mommy, can you put me on the blindfold? I don't, I don't have another blindfold. Hmm, you can use a sock. I can use Want me to use it on my own sock? Yep. Why do I have to use my sock? Because I don't have another blindfold. Okay, I'll use my own sock. Like, Mine is my eyes. They're okay. too tight. You tied it? How do you <laughs> tell me it's too tight? Okay. All right. Who wants to taste it first? Uh, Me. Where is it? Wait, I'm waiting for Shaylin to get hers tied. Can you tie it, Mommy? I can't get to you. Shay, Ryan, can you tie it for her? Right here, right here, right here. Where do I have it? There. <laughs> you just pulled it off. There. Take that. This is too short. I can't do that. Here, put a rubber band around it. Here. Hey, rubber band. I'm trying to give it to Rayon. Thank you. They said. Right there. It's up. And. Let's get the rubber band. Yeah, put it to it right there. Okay. I think right there. There. So, yeah. let y'all see what yeah. it is. Okay, now I can. Don't smush my eyes. I hope I don't accidentally burn myself. Burn yourself? Mm -hmm. How? Just like I can't see. What if it's somewhere where the pot is and burn? You won't burn yourself. Mommy got this. She got this. <laughs> Okay. Now don't say anything until Shaylin tastes it too. Did you taste enough to know what it tastes like? No, I didn't. Quit trying to read it. I'm not. I'm talking to Shaylin. Okay. Yeah, put this back on. Just close your eyes in here. Yes, I Hey, Bong Queen. I did. P. 
peas. Peas? <laughs> yes. What do you taste, Graham? I tasted celery. Yes. You want to try it again? Greens. A salad. <laughs> Mommy, um, a strawberry lemonade. What? Mango. Huh. Lime. You're just trying to read it. Mango. Lime. No. Um, zoo. <laughs> zoo. Raspberry. Brown. Tangerine. Brown. Melon. <laughs> Watermelon. <laughs> great. Thank you, Bob. Great, 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 great. What, watermelon? No. Great. Great. Uh, great. What does it taste like? Stop just guessing on flavors great. that you've seen in the store. Right. <laughs> let, me taste, let me taste it. Let me taste it. It's great. It does not taste like grapes. Hmm. Fruit salad. <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> tomatoes. No, it's not tomatoes. My hair. 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 Uh, hair. I hair. Hair. No. Hair. Uh, lettuce. No. Give us the hint. It's green. <gasps> Grass. No. <laughs> Broccoli. No. Green bean. <laughs> Greens. <laughs> no. Leaves. <laughs> what is it? Leaves. It's crunchy. Crunchy, green, crunchy. Uh, <gasps> celery. No, you already said celery. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We bamboo. Bamboo. <laughs> green <laughs> onion. No. <laughs> Mommy, what about? Oh. Tomatoes. Lettuce. Yeah, tomatoes. Lettuce. <laughs> is it lettuce? No. What is it? If I no, my um uh, broth is boiling out. That you are the same No. So what and what? I can't see. You can take your thing off. Oh my gosh, my eyes have <laughs> just. Why are you blinking so Because my eyes have to adjust to all of these lights. <laughs> Is that what was it? Can you not give up? No. No. We can't, we can't give up. Please. <laughs> Ew. Excuse fart. me. Fart. Fart. A minion. Minion fart. Mommy. Minion fart. Green apple. Green apple. No! A green orange. A green orange. A turn up. <laughs> mm. Broccoli. We said broccoli. Stop doing We said broccoli. Melon. I said melon. Mm -hmm. I give up. Tell us. Tell, please. <laughs> Tell us. Miss <laughs> Ariana's laughing at a turnip. Please, 
Rayon said no. They also have some cookies to try. Bug stripe, strawberry cheesecake. Hey, Passion B. Yank. Chocolate hazelnut Oreos. You can know these. And hot cinnamon Oreos. You're going to say what if they're good. Is <laughs> oh. And they want to taste this candy. Horseradish. Flowers. Tell us, Bobby. I give up. You give up. Yep. Mm. Give up. Apple pie. Mm. Give up. Can I taste it again? Give up, Ray. No. Give up. Wait, mint? No. Let me taste it again. Back up. Garlic. Yeah. Is he gone? Is he gone? There's a thing gone yeah. right over my eye. My kids are trying to guess the flavor of this uh, Gatorade. Just give up so we can do the cookies. Give up. Green Oreo. <laughs> oh my! Uh, Say excuse me, you farty. Okay, I give up. What is it? What is it? <laughs> It's cucumber lime. Ew! Cucumber lime. I thought y'all were at least going to say pickle. It tastes nothing like no pickle. It tastes like a homemade pickle. Um, pickle! Pickles, pickles. <laughs> I love pickles. When I tasted it, I thought it tasted like vinegars and, and cucumbers. Pickles. And that's what it tastes like to me. Cucumbers and vinegar. Mommy's brought far more for me because I'm never really hungry. Yeah, noodles don't take long to boil. They just have to come to al dente. What do you want to eat? Just salt. Just salt. Just soft enough to bite. It means to the tooth. Is it going to be good enough to that or do we need salt? Of course, salt, salt and the cheese. Why? Because that's what makes it look lasagna. <laughs> you just want to eat meat and, no and dry noodles? You can have some meat and dry noodles. We'll enjoy our food. <laughs> when I grow up, I'm going to make just some ground beef and eat it for dinner. You just want to eat meat. You're gonna be fat. <laughs> you want to be fat? No, but I want to eat meat. That'll make Why are you fat. looking at me like that? You're gonna have a heart attack just eat meat. <laughs> you need some vegetables. Eat some vegetables. The veggies. Meat and green beans. More. Green beans, corn, and macaroni and cheese. No, that's too much starch. That's too many carbs. Mm. Green beans and corn. Green beans, corn, and the meat. <laughs> <laughs> Add another vegetable. Broccoli. 
Okay. Eat some broccoli. I didn't notice you had to have all of these rules to eat. Yes, you do. It's just food. In fact, go get the bag of spinach out of the um, refrigerator. I bring my sandwich in here because I am starving. I thought you already ate the sandwich. I don't care. Yeah. More than um, you need to try the cookies after we eat the food. Please don't step on my mirror. Wait, so if we're gonna try the cookies after we eat the actual food, then I can eat in the room. Yay. I do you want to do it on cake? But what to bring you? A bag of spinach. We have spinach. Yeah, we have spinach. I always have spinach. I don't think I use it all spinach. I don't know. I don't think so. Push. Is it pulled? Yeah. It is pulled. Yeah, it's pulled. Pulled. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it is. It's quiet in there. Why is it so quiet? Why would it be loud? I'm just going to go to the room. I need my strainer thing so I can get these noodles out. Okay, my pasta is done. Watch out. Why is there a noodle? Because that's the one I just tested to see if the noodles are done. Is it yes, they're done. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So, come back. Wait, no. Okay, wait. I got to straighten out my leg. Oh, that hurts. Oh, okay. Mommy, why do you say each out when you straighten out your leg? Because it hurt. Okay. Here's your hands, baby. No, that one's mine. Y'all's are both in. What that, well, you ate yours. Rayon's is over in the bed. Wait. I like paper napkins. 
Babies, we don't. That's not to eat. That's life insurance. You already have that. You actually have like three of them. I missed a little one. I don't even know if I can use this. One. Mm -mm, this ain't gonna fit. It's not gonna fit. I need the smaller one. Are we going to use these bowls? You can use a bowl if you want to. I'm not. Are you going to use a plate? Mm -hmm. You can a bowl. Okay. Put my wallet back. Mommy, why did you have all the decoration on your other keys? And there's no decoration on the cup on these keys. Those weren't decorations, those were my different um store cards. Ah, so those are your cards. Mm -hmm. Like Blockbuster card and grocery store cards and Eckerd's card and CVS cards. Yeah, they're not decorations. Oh, I thought they were just in a walking. Yeah, they're membership cards. They're not decorations. You work at Walgreens? No, they're membership cards. So that's a membership card for Brookshire's grocery store, and that's a membership card for grocery, I mean, for Kroger's grocery store. And that was a membership card for Blockbuster's video. I did work at Blockbuster, though. I do these. Those things come in the mail, or do they? Oh, well, when you sign up for them, they have to mail them to you. Oh, they're not like in the store, you pick them up. Sometimes they're in the store, depends on the store. What's this one? I don't know. Washing me things so I can get my noodles out. That's strange. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do they consider people grown when they're 13? No. Very grown. You are an adult when you are 18, but you're not grown until you can pay your own bills and take care of yourself. Okay, I'm going to get you that box for a Well, that tastes good. <laughs> when it's cooked, it's going to taste good. Well, that's what it tastes good now. It's spinach. Mommy, why is it a leaf? The spinach is a leaf. Is it good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I need to make it. I thought you were going to do my smoothie, remember? Yeah. Some of this froze. 
If they were too tight. <laughs> um, I just put my spinach in here with my meat, and then I'm going to put it all back in my pan after I get my daughter to pour this um, broth out and add the sauce in, and I'm going to put it all together. Because, you know, the spinach doesn't take but, you know, long as it takes to heat up, it's going to cook. So it can all go together. Rayon, come get your pot holders and take the broth and go pour the broth out. Where's your pot holders? They'll pour it out outside. Yeah. Can I try to do it? Oh, it's weird. Sometimes Get the pot, the thing out. It's weird that sometimes I think there's somebody who's out there along with me. Maybe there is. Unless somebody. Lucas might be peeking out the window at you. Watching to make sure nothing yeah. bad happens. Good. Mm -hmm. 
I like playing in this. I just threw it. There's holes. Good. Yeah, I'm just throwing some garlic. spinach in there. Not it's garlic, it's spinach. Oh. Okay, click. Yeah, that's it. Very, very good. I put about half of a 16 ounce bag, so. Eight ounces of spinach. That's a lot. It's on me. Mm. You can throw this in the trash. Yeah. Oh, we're just gonna waste the spinach. Look, that spinach froze. Yeah. That was waste it. Why would you spill it? I'm not paying attention. Okay, stop eating up all the noodles. Is the best, mommy. Is meat the best out of all the food groups? No. Vegetables. Well, meat is the best to me. It gives you a lot of protein. Protein. You need vitamins. <laughs> Mostly protein. No, you need vitamins <laughs> and protein next. Vegetables first before you'll be Whatever you call it. Yeah, you can do it with Alfredo. You can do it with Alfredo. It's going on. Can I put it on two lips? Here comes the next. I'm gonna do one of those cookies. Might want to take that down. So it's already cooked, it's just gotta warm up. I will warm it. I thought you had to cook the spinach. The spinach didn't take very long. By the time it warms up, the spinach will be cooked. What color is the spinach supposed to be when it's cooked? It's just going to turn darker green. So it's going to turn dark. 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 Green. Mm -hmm. Rayana, I couldn't get this and wash it. Where my trash bag go? Where you don't even? Yeah. Mommy, I am a man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I am ready for work. I am a man. Broccoli is good in your pasta, too. In your spaghetti. My grandfather makes his spaghetti with broccoli in it, and it's really good. Yeah. Broccoli is also really good in your chili. Who puts it in their chili? Um, Bubba. Who's Bubba? Um, Uncle, uh, our boy's son. Bubba. Wait, do you need that back? Can you go back? The bowl? Wash it. Thank you. 
Marcus Sweet fell out. Cheese. Oh, but you have to put cottage cheese in it to make it taste like my lasagna. <coughs> I put cottage cheese in my lasagna, right? Um, huh? yeah. <coughs> so I put half of this container. Because I bought the really big one. Because I want some uh, cottage it cheese makes tomorrow. Really fast it, it will, uh, everything will everywhere. Yeah. And then I'm going to use the whole thing of ricotta. What is ricotta? It's another kind of cheese. It's milky. Mm -hmm. You have to mush. I'm not going to mush it. I'm just going to fold it in. You should be sliced it. I'm going to mush it for all the Ooh, that looks good. Yep. Oatmeal spinach rolled out. What is stump chicken du jour? Stump chicken. It's good with turkey meat or um, ground chicken. Ground chicken? It's good, mommy. Mommy, when you do this, where does the strap go? In your stomach, down your throat, and in your stomach. That's why it's supposed to blow it? your nose, and because it's in your throat, it goes down your throat and then into your stomach. That's why they say you should blow your nose instead of doing that, because you're swallowing it when you do that. You don't want to swallow it. You want to blow it out. Your hand hurts. Make some hand crap stop. What's that? Worcestershire sauce. Can I put one in my hand? So does this give it the flavor? Yeah. I put in a little Worcestershire sauce and a uh, bay leaf. Because I always put that in my spaghetti and my, um, any of my pasta sauce. Hi, Lady Anne. Thank you for joining. Because it's starting to bubble down at the bottom. Who made this for you before? No one. I made it up myself. Y'all asked for lasagna, and there was no time to fix lasagna, so I made this.
<laughs> yeah, du jour, tell us what stump chicken is. You want to know what stump chicken is? Mm -hmm. What is it? Chicken with a bone as big as a stump. What? Why is it big as a skunk? The spawn's moving on me. <coughs> <coughs> Chicken with a bone as big as a stump. Did you put that on your um, shoes on there? I put an envelope on there. That's old. That would be very, 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 very messy. I put about half of this in there. I don't know. Is it a special type of chicken? I don't understand. I need a good one. Quiet. Climb back up here. Stay down. Put me a little bit of water in this one and a little bit of water in this one. Just to this little one down here. A little bit in both. Just wait. Okay? Because you decided to leave. And now you want to come immediately back. Just wait a minute. Let me finish what I'm doing, okay? Can you move this Yes. What are you doing? Can I move my toes? Yeah. Everybody can move their toes. Or not everyone. Most people can move their toes. Yeah. I guess it's just a really big chicken. I mean, <laughs> a really big chicken? Yeah. I've never heard of such. Have you heard of such? No. Mm -hmm. Can you open this? Here we go. 
Yeah, I'll just pour this into this one. That's what I'll do. And I put a little too much, right? Yeah. Watch out. It's bubbling round. Does that mean it's good? Looks like this is cottage cheese is for sure. Okay. Yes, I'm on my bed. I was in a lot of pain today, so I didn't go in there. In the kitchen. Why is your channel following on this kitchen? Because that's what I call my business. Uh, and kitchen. Uh -huh. It's my like granny's business is called Nikki's Kitchen. Nikki's Kitchen? Uh -huh. Is that her nickname? Nikki, yeah. Oh. Can it Nikki's Kitchen? Yeah. Nikki. Because her name is Monique, right? So her nickname, her nick, the nickname is Niki. 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 Right, not Nikki. Niki. Niki. And so her business belongs to her. So it's Niki's kitchen. Right. Hi, Chatilde72. Thank you, DeJour. Thank you, Lady Ann. Yeah, I was telling them earlier, um, there have been times because I have, um, I have a fake knee, but I also have a reattached foot um, that I haven't been able to walk. So I also have pinched nerve and slip discs in my back. I have two slip discs in my back. And sometimes I can't walk. And so I have some gadgets that allow me to be able to feed my children and not leave my room if I don't have to. Um, before I actually, um, we lived in a rent house before I had my house and, um, actually stayed on my couch because my room was actually too far to have to walk. So I actually stayed on the couch for a long time and I did so for my couch. A lot of my friends called me the couch cook because I did everything from my couch and I just had my daughter bring me whatever I needed. She bring me a wash basin. She brought me all the food and I cooked my couch using... This thing right here, a pressure cooker and a toaster oven. And I cook, you know, them three meals a day, everything they needed. And, you know, I couldn't walk, but my babies got fed, you know. Um, so if I have a day where I'm like, you know what? Mama can't walk. I say, hey, bring me blah, 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 blah. Let me fix you some food. And that's what we do. 
you know, mama's gonna fix you something to eat regardless. So, yeah. They never go hungry. No, the food is right here. She didn't go hungry. Never go hungry. No, the food is cooking, therefore you not going hungry. So this is just about done. I think I put everything in here. Oh no, I have not. We have one more layer of cheese to go. One more layer of cheese. Goodness, Rayon, you need to come plug in the oven, or actually, you can just take this cheese toast to into the kitchen and put it in the oven in there. I want to get fire again. Can we use this? Okay, we'll use that one then. You what? Can you give me a second? Yeah. Just wait. Hold on. Let me get this in here and then she can come back over here. Ooh, the food looks good. The tacos done too, right? Mm -hmm. Just gonna make the cheese toast and let this simmer for a second. Where's the lid to this? I forgot to wash the lid. I don't go hungry at all. I know you don't. But sometimes at school I go hungry because they claim that they run out of food. And they should never claim they ran out of food. They should always have something if it's nothing but a peanut butter sandwich. Thank you, DeJour. Mm -hmm. Mommy, do I know that face? You know what face? Mm -hmm. Me thinking? Yes. Yeah. I think I know. That I'm face. sure you do. Do we have radish? No, we don't have any radish. Excuse me. Boom, done. Sounds like sciatica outsider. That pain that I get the very back of my back, the lower part of my back that shoots down my leg. Hey, hey, stop it. Don't knock over my oven. Wait, I was going to cook it right here. Yeah, you can put it right there. I was just trying to finish it. Okay, but you can't do it like that. You can't be touching it either. But it's gonna get hot and it's gonna burn you sitting right there. Okay. What is this? That's my medicine for my tongue. 
Do you have to drink it? No, I just swish it around. Okay. Mommy, how, much, onion. how much does that barbecue pit weigh? What did it weigh? Uh, I think it was 79 pounds. That's, it was heavy, I know that. That thing, that's lower than me. No, higher than you. Try picking it up. Higher than you. Dead weight is heavy. Okay, Boogie, come on. Yes, he does, Joe Alice. Yes, he does. What happened to the build a bear that I can you tell him our little brother? Because mm -hmm. he was small. Now I call my baby little sister. She's small. Okay, bye -bye. Oh, I see. I'm not to be in here. You can be in here. You got to do the, do the um, bread. Yeah. Oil. Let's put it on. Turn the oil uh, toaster on. It's going to be warming up. Why are you tearing up your bowl? You make it weak, it's going to, the uh, lasagna is going to pour out of it. Put it on bake? Yes, put it on bake at uh, 350. Actually, put it on bake or broil? Actually, put it on 425 on bake. Some big bread. Yeah, it's Texas toast. Three, 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 three. Mommy, three, 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 three. Is this high enough? Okay. So, well, bottles of things at the top, or are they not going to turn? Around. Hey, DC and Lisa. Hello. Hello. Bake four twenty five, right? Yes. We're just going to have this right here. <coughs> I started to buy a loaf of French bread, but we let bread go bad when I buy loaves. So I was like, nah, put that in the freezer. Whenever I bring home a whole loaf of French bread, we'll never eat it. No, we like it. We just don't eat that much. What's a free loaf? I said French bread, a loaf okay. of French bread. So put it in here. We gotta wait for it to preheat. It's not hot yet. Turn it on. I told you to turn it on already, remember? <laughs> Is it gonna beat? 
-hmm. Here, go put my anti fee seasoning back. This is my anti fee seasoning that she made me with her own hands. Wait, she actually made you it? Mm -hmm. I was present this seasoning and never used it because she died. Yeah, I have some in there that um, she made and I have some that Dawn made. <coughs> You're going to sit in the way back there. Mommy, where are I you? I told you we're friends. Yeah. Here, go snap this back on the back of my um thing. It's um just like um what's the word that I want to say? Yeah, I told you to go sit it in there. It's got the rice in it. It's it's cooling down. Um, melding. The flavors are melding together right now. So we're getting while our um our toast is is fixing, and by the time our toast is ready, then our um we'll be ready. Why do we have to wait until the toast is ready? Because the toast goes with the food. <laughs> Night, DC and Lisa. Here's my food. You want to see? Looks yummy. Tell us if it looks yummy. This is hot. Cause this is hot. It's nice and hot and warm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this is really mm -hmm. I'm glad it's quiet today. Because she knows I'm filming. I asked y'all to be quiet. What are you doing? Okay, Rayon, come check the toaster. What are you doing? It's not really a toaster. Welcome to the thing with your own All right, come what put this in there. What are you doing, Rayad? Nothing. You're making so much noise while eating my daughter. Can't make so much noise. You like poetry. Moo is not supposed to feed your daughter. She can't cook. Moo is allowed to feed my daughter. Please. Is Moo allowed to feed my daughter? Because They're over here. Where are you going? The bed is daddy. Right there. You have to get the baby before Moo feeds her. Moo don't know how to cook. <laughs> What are you doing? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Cut. 
cover your mouth when you cough. So we really got to stop going back and forth. Can y'all hear the convection of it? Go wash your hands. Come on over, Joe Alice. That's right, Miss Ariana. Some people do. Some people do. It's getting good. It's getting good. <laughs> Poor kids eat nothing but ramen noodles and corn dogs and frozen pizzas. Never see a real meal. No Making my own. Snort trying to make her a bottle and she puts onions in bottles. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why I don't want to make her a bottle. You coming over here? Yeah. Mm -hmm.
Rayon, come check the toast. Open it up and look. I can hear it sizzling, but oh, I can see some brown spots. So, does it look done? No, not lots of brown spots. See if I can find this Bailey. I can't eat the Bailey. No, you never want to bite into a Bailey. Why? It doesn't taste good if you bite into a Bailey. It just gives its flavor. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste good to bite directly into it. You better cook it first. I think I found the Bailey. That's some cheese. No crispy cheese. That's some crispy cheese. That's not my No, it doesn't change. It stays at least. It doesn't cook. It doesn't get soft or anything. It just stays a big, flat one. Well, when you take it out, it might be in the bottom. In a ball. In the bottom. At the bottom. I'm scraping the bottom. Bottom, scraping the sides. I just told you it has a very strong bitter flavor. You don't want to bite the bay leaf. It's hot. I'll put it right there. You can lick the bay leaf. All right, don't bite it. I'm telling you, you're not going to like the taste. Oh, 
Ayan. Ayan. Yeah, bring Moo to um. Yeah, um be like. Where's <laughs> Sorry, so then now. I like to play last time with Mhm. Why are y'all licking babies? I'm not. She did. She wants to lick the baby. Well, I heard somebody say, I whipped it. It's nasty. It's like a mom. No, I said it's not good to bite it. She asked me what happens if you bite a bay leaf. I told her it's nasty. Here's our, um, here's our garlic toast. Here's plate. Green plates. She wants a bowl. Do you want a bowl? No. Okay. This is how we do it. This what do y'all do? This is how we do it. Who saw it? This is how we do it. Um this is how we do it. What's his name? Um, oh, shoot. What is his name? Oh, my name was straight What? This is how we do. <coughs> what is his name? Oh, I can't oh, remember. Wait, Jordan something. Montel Jordan. Mom, wait, you haven't prayed yet. I mean, that's the prayer. Shame it. Because yeah. you pray before you eat. Because we wouldn't even have no spaghetti if it weren't for God. It's the same thing. No. Spaghetti doesn't have spirit. The spirit is not so good. We get the flavor. Thank you. Hey. Mm. No. Not doing it. Get out of the ball. Let's show them. Bye. I'm going to show mine. Okay, y'all. Uh. Here's my plate. <coughs> we have spazagna and garlic bread. And again, the spazagna has ground beef, ground sausage, and Italian sausage in it. It has ricotta cheese, um, cottage cheese, Italian blend cheese, Parmesan, Asiago, and Romano cheese. And four blend spaghetti sauce, pasta sauce, and spinach. I put fresh spinach in it. And then I use Bucatini pasta. Have the spinach. 
I said spinach. spinach. And, and the one with the holes in it. Yep. Yes. And that's it. Okay. Is it fair? You gonna say it or you want me to say it? I want to say it. Okay. Thanks, his Father, we thank you for the food and back to receive and the nourishment of our body. In Christ's name, we do pray. Amen. Remember the Sabbath and keep it holy. Yes, I keep it holy. Blessed are the merciful, for this is thy mercy. Yeah. Amen. Um. I don't really have a, a scheduled time that I go live right now. Um, I don't know, it's probably like the fourth or fifth time that I've gone live now. Um, Ram, I'm glad you caught it. <laughs> um, I'm also going to be cooking tomorrow. I don't think it'll be live. I might do some of it live. I'm going to be making Japanese food tomorrow. Do um, some of my prep tomorrow live um, during the day while the girls are at school. Um, Y'all saw me. I was making the rice already. Um, I have to like make up the gyoza and make up the um, egg rolls. So I might do some of that live while they're at school. I got to chop up all the cabbage and onions and all that stuff too. Um, but I think the actual cooking, I'm just going to record and make a video of that. Uh, so I can like try and aim my camera so that it can really get, you know, show how I'm like making the fried rice and stuff like that. But yeah, is it good? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Very. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Ariana. I try to cook a lot of stuff that they're going to eat because I can't eat. <laughs> I've had a gastric bypass, so I don't eat very much. So I just try and make the stuff that I know they like. And, um, you know, it's kind of what I cook. Pick stuff that I know they like because they're going to eat it up. And then I force myself to eat some. She's my little vegetarian. I can give her a bunch of veggies and she's real happy. The other one loves meat, as you heard her saying over and over. She 
but me and this one, we could live on, you know, soup <laughs> and be happy. Soup and smoothies. Me and her be good. As long as I bought her some peanut butter and some bread and she could have a sandwich now and then. She'd be good. And some honey. And some honey. Let's go sleep outsider and dream that you're eating something. I'll wake up in the morning and eat some cereal. <laughs> go sleep now. And then you got to drink all the night and then yeah, eat some cereal or something. I'm making ashes, please. Thank you. I don't have a set time, Alice. I say at least once a week. It just depends on if I find something fun for them to do. Or like if I know something that I have for me to cook live. But I might go live again tomorrow. I want to tell you about to spill some on that side.
It was good. You want some more? No? Okay. There's so much meat. You don't have to eat all the meat if you don't want it. I can never want meat. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Joe Alice. Oh, excuse me. Brian still eating? Yeah. The oldest had more than both of us. She could eat more than both of us. <coughs> Once, she only ate a tiny bit of her food and she was finished. Oh. Yeah. It's because she'd already eaten. <laughs> when you finish, come on so y'all can do these cookies. Hmm? I told you already. I was just a boy that I could not sound like a boy. He said, yes, you do. It looked crazy. He just wanted to be mean. And that was the only thing he could think of to say. Pick up the crumb that you got. Sure. In your lap. You almost finished? No. Please eat your food. I love eating the cookies, though. Mm. Okay, y'all. What I'm going to do is I'm going to close this and then come back live and let them do this cookie tasting. So I'm going to close this one out and then start a new one of them tasting cookies so they can get ready for bed. Have to taste. It's just three cookies. And you don't have to eat the whole cookie, just taste it and then tell them what it tastes like and if you like it. Okay? Okay, so we will be right back on a different stream. Oh my goodness. What if they taste like a gopher? Like a gopher. <laughs> it's a gopher. <laughs> Something that I just made up. <laughs> 